Hello everybody and welcome to Luxury Benefits channel. My name is Sviatoslav and in this video I would like to talk about awakening process for the eyes. Stretching, yawning and squinting exercise, ears on the crown exercise, finger in front of the nose exercise and about morning palming. It is important how you start the day. The recommendations that I will set out next are borrowed from the book Get Rid of Glasses by the Bates Method. It's amazing that Bain professional ophthalmologist Dr. Bates released a hundred years ago what is the meaning of correct awakening for the eyes. In this topic, the American doctor proved himself as a system specialist, the perceiving human body as a whole. As Bates himself wrote in his book, many people complain that their eyes in the morning is still sleepy and an hour passes or more before it's possible to make the fully usable. This condition is caused by the fact that the eyes of many people in a dream, they sometimes strain more than during wakefulness. In association with this, we need to bring the eyes into working condition for a very long time, cheering yourself up with various exercises. Meanwhile, only 5 to 10 minutes is enough to bring both the body and the eyes and the brain in an active state. Just few minutes that a person usually spends anyway in bed already awake. Stretch yourself. Stretch well while laying in bed, stretching first one half of the body, then the other. To do this, stretch up one hand, pulling down the same leg at the same time. Then repeat everything with the other side of the body. Do this several times and then pull upwards both hands at once and downwards both legs. Pull the toes out yourself first, then pull back your heels, pointing your toes. You can do similar stretching in a different direction. Simultaneously pull your right arm and your left leg down and vice versa. After that, roll from side to side several times. Breathe deeply and rhythmically as you do this. What does this stretching give us? The fact is that in a dream we are not capable of controlling the position of our body. Someone sleeps on its side, someone on stoma or curled up. For this reason a person full blood circulation is disturbed. Some muscles and organs stagnation is formed in the tissues. Turning on your back and stretching well, you put in a place muscles of the whole body and limbs and rolling from side to side, especially on hard surfaces, makes a wonderful back massage and enhance blood circulation through the body. Yawning and squinting. Open your eyes and mouth wide while making a sound like a long lingering uh, Repeat the exercise four times, yawning with relish. You can connect pulling and yawning together on awakening. So how much your pads stretch and bend back and pause with wide open mouth. We need to take an example from them, especially since many people sleep clenching their jaws and even cracking teeth in a dream. To relax the muscles of the jaw and face, it is recommended widely and loudly yawn in the morning. Close your eyes tightly for 3-4 seconds three times and then do 12 light blinks. This is the easiest and most beneficial way to increase blood circulation in eyes. Squinting and blinking also helps to clear the eyes of everything in accumulated overnight, but also makes it possible to quickly turn on muscles of the eyes and eyelids to work. Remember how much and how often we have to blink 
blink during the day so that our eyes are less tired of visual work. Ears on the crown exercise. Raise your eyebrows several times to achieve the sensation movements in the upper part of the ears at the level of the forehead. This is a well known exercise for the eyebrows, especially useful after a night of inactivity. It will help to remove a feeling of heaviness with the eyebrows, which appears with constant eye strain. Such eyebrow movements have a beneficial effect on vision and appearance. Your face will literally change when the tension will leave you. Place your finger in front of the nose while still in bed. Make finger twists 20-30 times. Place your index finger in front of the bridge of your nose and do 3-4 turning, now with closed and then with open eyes. As a result, you will finally wake up and get rid of congestion in the neck and head. Pursuing the illusion of movement finger, you will relieve tension not only from the eyes, but also literally from every part of the body. There are three options for doing this exercise. First, keep your finger in front of your nose at eye level and gently turn your head from side to side while looking past fingers until the illusion appears that the finger is moving. Second, the illusion of finger movement can be achieved even faster if put the base of your finger to the tip of the nose and make three turns heads with closed eyes, three with open. Finger at the same time stays in place, we just lightly brush it with the tip of the nose when movement. Third, hold your palm with fingers spread out in front of your eyes and turn your head, then closing, then opening your eyes. While looking through your fingers as so through holes in a fence, exercise are performed 30-60 times in the morning and in the evening, as well as eyes get tired. In all cases, we don't stick with our eyes to the finger, just a glance at the object passing by us. It is best to do this exercise while laying in bed, driving the back of your head on the pillow. We are guaranteed to relieve tensions from the neck and we massage the back of the head, the zone of visual analyzers. You can do any exercise you like. You can use a pen, candle or other object instead of fingers holding it in front of the nose at eye level. The main thing is to get the feeling that the fingers moves and at the same time remain in comfortable, relaxed condition. What is it for? The fact is that with such monotonous movement subject before the eyes, the relaxation occurs at the level of the nervous retinal tissue. To see clearly, the cells of our retina make many frequent saccadic movements as if scanning objects around. These small movements are so fast that the desired speed is achieved mobility in a conscious way is impossible. Problems with the speed of micro movements at the cell level retinas arise precisely in people with poor vision, whose eyes are in a constant stress state. So when you achieve the illusion of a finger movement or hands in the opposite direction from turning the head, speed the movement of the retinal nerves will be 70 to 120 times per second we need. The same happens with the imaginary swinging on the hand before your eyes. Use this technique as often as possible because it perfectly shoots tension not only from the eyes 
face, face, neck, but literally from every cell of our body. As Bates states in his book, this technique is an excellent prevention of cervical osteochondrosis and excellent remedy for headaches. Make sure that the chin moved strictly in one line and stretch as much as possible to shoulder. To relieve headaches you need to do not 30-40 movements and perform turns from 5 to 15 minutes. Don't forget only about the correct posture. Free breathing and remember if you are slightly nauseous or dizzy it means that you began to stick your eyes to your finger. The best way to relieve this discomfort is alternately closing and opening the eyes every 3-4 turns. The finger immediately moves in the opposite direction from the turn of the head direction and the nausea will soon pass. Morning Palming Laying on your back, place a pillow under your elbows and swipe palming. 5 minutes of palming will help you take all the night tension and give yourself another already more detailed installation on your day and also feel more refreshed, ready to work in throughout the day. Some people wonder why to give a rest to the eyes in the morning if they are all night had a rest. I think Bates advise doing this relaxing exercise when we wake up feeling sore and gritty in eyes. This happens if we worked a lot of the computer the day before, read, write or watch television. Morning palming just a little will support the eyes in front of new loads on them. Uncomfortable sensations are in the eyes and when we did not get enough sleep or had terrible dreams, closing your eyes with your palms, you can come down and give yourself a little more rest. The main thing is not to fall asleep in palming again like this happens sometimes to some people. Thanks for watching this video to the end. Today we learn how important to start a new day about stretching, yawning, squinting, finger twist exercise and morning palming. I hope it will help you. Subscribe to my channel for more great benefits and we'll see you again.